Hello, how's it going? I'm uh, I'm Buttery Toast on Twitch.tv. Uh, so if you like the video, make sure you give me a follow or just come in, come and come see what games I'm playing, see if you like it or not. Okay, so it's just gonna be a quick tutorial on how to make the Eric Andre will be right back me. Um, it looks something like this. Just like that. Um, so you'll have to excuse the camera quality. I've only got a 720p camera, but it might look better on yours. Anyway, so it's fairly simple. We only need to download two things. And um, obviously we need to get our sources as well. So let me just go to my display capture. Okay, so this is my display capture now. So we're gonna need to go, go to your browser, uh, open up freeze filter, and stream effects. I'll put these links in the description for you. So just download them, unpack them using something like WinRAR. Um, I think most people have that already for themselves, but here we are. And all you need to do is just copy and paste them into your OBS folder. For those that don't know, um, it's probably located in your C drive, program files, OBS studio, and literally just drag and drop into here and replace any files it asks you to replace. Um, it's going to give you two plugins, freeze filter and sweet effects. The freeze filter does what it says on the tin. Um, it basically makes you able to, to recreate the effect by adding the filter to your camera. And stream effects, you need that so you can create a source mirror. Um, it's also quite a handy thing to have for OBS anyway. Also, um, you can do this yourself or you can just download a PNG like I did. It's definitely a lot easier doing what I did. We'll be right back, PNG. Save that, paste it into OBS, and you'll need the sound as well. So I went into YouTube, we'll be right back, sound effect meme, that's the one I went for, and I literally went into YouTube to MP3 and downloaded that, okay? So we don't have to worry about all that anymore once you've installed those plugins and got all the media you'll need. Okay, let's get started. So we're going to need the image, doesn't matter what order you do this in, so image, browse, let's find that meme for you guys. Um, there we go, we'll be right back. Add that in. Move that to the right hand side maybe. I think, I believe the meme, that's how it does it. Um, we're going to add our media source, which is the music. So music, I'm gonna label that as music, browse. Go find your music file. We'll be right back. Sound effect meme. There. Lovely stuff. And then we're going to need our source mirror. So you see it there. Source mirror. Add source mirror. Okay. Source. Which source do we want to pick? We want to pick the webcam. So find your webcam. Done. There it is. There I am. Um, just as a personal preference, I like to have it flipped. So my room looks a bit bigger. You probably won't have to do this. Okay. I'm just going to close out down the display capture so you can see a bit clearer. So I'm going to go into enlarge this. Boom. Going to put that to the bottom. Put the we'll be right back text on top. And then what you need to do now is you need to disable the image from view with this little icon. I'll show you here. You need to disable like that. Like that, you see? Disable that and disable the sound effect as well. So disable the music. And then what we need to do here, I need you to click on the source mirror, filters, and then effect filters here, add, freeze. And that's what's going to give us the effect, the freeze effect that we're after. Add that in. And then as you can see, activate action, deactivate action. Don't worry about that just yet. Um, I don't know how to do stuff like that. Literally for the purpose of this, you won't need it. So close this down. So this is your we'll be right back scene. So th this this essentially is your we'll, we'll be right back. Yada, yada, yada. So now that we've made that scene with all these lovely sources, what we're going to do is we're going to look at our hotkeys now. So settings, hotkeys, 
and what we're going to need. We're going to need to make sure that we have our freeze set to F1 or whatever binding you guys want. I've got mine to F1. Source mirror, enable freeze, disable freeze, set to F1. Okay. And what, what's that going to do? It's going to enable freeze on the source mirror only. Okay. Also, we need to bind. So as you can see, we'll be right back. Show image, show sound effect on F1. So then once you do those three things, it'll look something like this. So I press F1. And as you can see, it freezes, plays the sound, and shows the image. Simple as that. Now we need to add that to our main scene. So you can so instead of switching transitioning to different scene, it's much easier just to have it as a nested scene in your main scene. Well that's what I've done anyway. Someone else might correct me. I don't know. Um so this is my main scene here. This is my main scene. And as you can see, so pl press plus scene here and then add the we'll be right back to your main scene or wherever you want it. It's up to you. Um, so I can be chatting away, I can be playing, I can be gaming, and then I press F1 and pull a silly face or something like that. Or say I just want to go for break. I can do that as well. Uh, so add the scene into your main scene, and then we're going to set up one more hotkey. Settings, hotkeys, and then once it's in your actual main scene itself, I'll show you with my display capture. Once it's in your main scene itself, and everything's like working as it should, go onto your main scene, show will be right back, hide will be right back. So what you're doing there is you're showing the other scene and then you're hiding the other scene as well. Um, and it also takes priority over my main scene. Um, sorry if I've confused anyone there, but I think once you kind of do it yourself, you'll kind of get to grips with it. Um, so once again, um, this is the effect in all its glory. So, right, I'll see you guys hopefully on my Twitch sometime soon. Uh, remember to like and comment. You can always message me on Discord um, or just pop into, my pop into my stream and ask me any questions you like. Um, right, so a bit, guys. Bye.